So uh, turns out we are actually the backup flight to another flight. So they are transporting us out to the airfield where we have to sit and wait and see if they fly that other flight. If they don't, then we will go to pole. And if they do, then we come back here for another night. Please fasten your seatbelt. Do not open the door when we come to a stop. Uh, I'll find out the scoop when we get there, whether they want you to go straight to the plane or if you're gonna hang out for a while. So hang on and I'll try to make it as short and painless as possible. Thanks, Jeff. Yeah, you're welcome. Thanks, Jeff. Apparently your fate is still being decided, <laughs> so um, please either be at the uh, Delta or in the galley because if they do want you to go, they're going to want me to round you up pretty quickly, okay? Sure. All right. Just be careful coming out. Turns out they still don't know what we're doing. There's a perk out there getting ready though. That's probably ours if, uh, if we do go right there. Turns out they changed their minds again. We had to, we got almost all the way back to McMurdo and then we turned around again. It's like a 45 minute drive. So we spent like almost like two hours in this, in this vehicle right there. Um, yeah, apparently we're flying to Pole now. So we're gonna get there at like 2 a.m. It's gonna be real lovely. Uh, let's go to South Pole. After almost having a mechanical failure, we are now finally going. Everything seems to be taken, so. At about 4, 4-ish in the morning. Good times. That's home for the next nine and a half months. This is a very exhausting walk. 10,000 feet. Oh man. Not that cold though. Mr. Wayne. Check that out. Hey man. <laughs> How are you doing? I'm alive. Looks the same. Yeah, it has to be. Do as well. Woo! Yeah, we did a little earlier, but I bet you do too, huh? Yeah, a little bit. Great. <sighs> Anybody just arriving? Hi, hang on here. welcome back. Thank you much. It's great to see you. You as well. Sorry, I kept you guys up so oh, late. It's okay. <sighs> We're gonna do 
super duper quick orientation. Right. Cool. So, just go ahead and drop your bags and coats. All right. I'm here. Um, this is not my final room. I'm just here temporarily for the rest of the summer. I'll be moving once winter starts. As you can see, it's very small. It's, uh, yeah, not very big. But I'm back at the South Pole. Guess is where I'm at for the next nine and a half months. <laughs> Let's do it.